Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Facebook Live at the University of Sewing. I'm Alice. Uh, Denise told you yesterday that Margaret is off having fun this weekend, mm -hmm. so I'm here to do this today. And this is Sabrina. She's Hello. one of our employees that work here, so I wanted you to introduce her. And today we are going to talk about some of the fun things that we have new in the store today. So let's kind of, I'm going to move on around oh, here. Excuse me. Yep. And we have a lot of fun things today. Um, first thing, we have our batting in. We've got some nice heirloom batting. These are queen size bundles that are right here. This is cotton. But what is unique to our store is that we have black batting. How many of you have used uh, regular batting and maybe your back is dark or your front piecing of your quilt is dark and you've gotten it off the machine and there's little tufts that have poked out and it's white. Well, use black batting. So we have black batting here in the store. Now we got in something fun this week. These, remember the kids had those slap bracelets and they just kind of, you know, slapped like that they had all sorts of designs and fun things. Well, guess what? They're really, really useful. Look at this nice stabilizer roll. I don't have to have tape. I don't have to have um, anything else. I can put those slap things right around my stabilizer roll. I could use it on, they went that way, there we go. I could use it on a spool of thread to keep it handy. And the neat thing about it, here we've got, uh, how many come in there? 12, 12 of them come in there. There's three colors and it comes with a pen. So you can write on there that this is the poly mesh, this is the embroidery batting. You could name them and have them already there. That's kind of the coolest thing around. All right, so that's new. Next thing we have, couple things. How many of you have ever done your embroidery and your hoop is just running around on the thing you can't keep it straight? Look at this. This is a hoop mat. It's not going to move. So I can now put my embroidery hoop on there and it helps keep it straight. $25. Really useful. But it also has the grids. Do you see the grid line? I have it now. I can tell that I've got this centered on there. So it's going to help me a lot in my hooping. We have those in stock. Next thing we have. Hey Alice, yeah. Kathy and Brenda have already shared. Do hey, we have hey, anything hey. for a giveaway? We do this morning. I have found myself um, this past week looking for just a silly hand needle. And so we have these nifty little cards. Look at that nice variety of needles that are in there. And a needle threader. It's oh. in a, a nice little package so you can put them back and it's got a magnet on there. So I thought if I'm, I can't be the only one that's missing needles around here somewhere, right? So here's a nice little hand needle pack. Hand is not a four-letter word. You need to do, be able to do hand sewing at times. And all the quilters know that. So we have, we have a nifty little needle pack to share. So please share. That's how we know that you have shared and we can put you in for that drawing. So awesome, thank you. Good morning, ladies. Next thing we have. Sometimes my fingers aren't working as good as they should, so I'm struggling to tighten that up. We have a nifty thing, it's called a hoop key do. We have screw key do's for tightening and untightening your needle bar, but look at this. This is for your embroidery hoop. Just a nice nifty knob to be able to screw and unscrew. People try that and they're sold. These things are all of $10. Best, best little thing around today. Now, several of you are traveling. I know some of you have been to the Paducah Quilt Show. Um, we're starting to be traveling. We have graduation coming up next weekend here in town. So um, while you're here, 
come on by. We are open Friday from 10 to 6 and Saturday 10 to 5, so we'd love to have you here. Um, and also, as far as traveling, we carry these nifty books. They're called Needle Travel. It has stores, and they have a, a website. You can look it up on the website, but I like a good book. You know, sometimes you're traveling out and about. Some of these little towns don't have huge amounts of Wi-Fi. So I can look up by state, and I can say, oh, look. And guess what, everybody? We're in here, too. So this is a needle travel book, 2022, all the stores in the country. Really great little thing to have. Okay, we have some fabric this week. We have got in some fabric, and Margaret doesn't even know about some of it. <laughs> so if she's watching, good morning, Margaret, you're going to get to see the new fabric. This is a Japanese fabric. It's a canvas, but look at that pretty blue print. Oh my, this would make a great dress. Think of the pharaoh dress. How soft and comfy. This dress has pockets in that seam line. This would be a huge, or a, a beautiful dress in that. It's a little bit heavier, but just because it's called a canvas doesn't mean that it's stiff. It's not. It's got some drape to it. It's That, in a Japanese term, is describing how the weave is on it. So there's that pretty canvas. It's 45 inches wide, cotton. The next one we have is a Japanese fabric as well. And this is linen. It's called a linen sheeting. 45 inches wide, 100% linen. Look how soft and drapey that is. Oh my heavens, wouldn't that be a great summer shirt? And the color is kind of a dusty blue. I know our colors come up pretty good, but I don't know how everybody's computer reads that. But I look at this as a blank canvas. I see some nice embroidery on there. This would just make a super embroidered summer shirt. So that is in the system. It is online. So if you go to our website, University of Sewing, you can see that. Next new one we have is a cotton and linen. This is an Italian one. Look at this, this is intriguing to me. A Little bit different kind of print than we have here, but isn't it beautiful? Those Jacobean style flowers, think of a a maxi skirt or even a pair of culottes or I thought of a light summer jacket made out of this Thayer jacket kind of a jeans jacket look you could use our, our flat felling feet on the Bernina and make some really cool top stitching wow this is an awesome piece of material and look at there it's 60 inches wide so cotton and linen a little bit different, but I love it. Next Italian fabric we have is, get this right, it is a linen and cotton well, 55% linen, 45 cotton. Look at the pretty print on that. and you can see the drape. Doesn't that make you happy? That's, that's a happy fabric. Just a pretty dress, skirt, little jacket out of that. Oh, put a, put a peachy colored sweater with it and a pretty skirt or a dress. A vintage style dress. Some of the sew over it patterns have vintage dresses. Also 60 inches wide. That green is really pretty too. So there's, there's a new piece of fabric. We think garments around here. We always look at our quilting fabric and we think, wouldn't that make a nice shirt or 
what can we do with that? You know, a pair of pants or a dress or so we, we look at all of our fabrics just a little bit di differently. Next piece we have is a knit. And basics, think basics. How many of you just need a nifty t-shirt to put underneath that, you know, on top of a pair of jeans or something? A beautiful toast. It's called Toasted Taupe is its name. But 100% cotton jersey. It's got four-way stretch to it. And you know we do knits here. Margaret has a t-shirt class that's almost full. So we have classes that are really starting to go around here. Go on our website, look at our class calendar. Um, I think we keep saying over and over, if there's a group of you and you want to learn how to do a t-shirt or a dress or a skirt or something, get a group together. We can hold a special class. So that's that knit. This is the same brand of knit. It's a jersey, just, you know, cotton jersey, just as well, but in navy, beautiful neutral, 60 inches wide. Ready for your, ready to make into a wonderful t-shirt for the summer. How classic is that? Start with the basics, start with the classics. You've got toasted taupe, and this one's called deep sea, deep sea navy. All right. I thought of the pattern with these two fabrics. Here's a pattern, it's called the Urban T-shirt. And it's got two different halves and, and you make it that way. And why couldn't you color block that? Have one half of the T-shirt navy and one half taupe? There you go. You don't have to do anything else. You've got a nifty t-shirt. All right. Some other fabrics. This is one of those quilting fabrics that we went, oh my, isn't this pretty for a dress or a blouse? This is Robert Kaufman fabric, and it's a sateen. If you don't know what a sateen is, it's the way it's woven. And it's got a beautiful, soft finish on top. Look at those pretty flowers. That makes you happy. It's one of those happy fabrics. That's why it's so fun to work here. If you guys know of anybody who wants to work here, or you want to work here yourself, we're looking for people. So we'd be glad to have you. Now next, we got in some Northcott fabrics. We probably got in more, this is called Bliss, and this is kind of a whole line, and these are called Bubbles, Bubble Tees, and these are Ombres. And I forgot to grab that pattern. We have two patterns that are specifically for these. Maybe we can take a walk and find them. But look at that, it goes from dark to light. So, ombre fabrics are really nice. You've got the whole color scheme in here, but say you need a block of dark, you need a block of light. You know, how they're very useful in your quilts. So we've got that, and we've got four colors of it. This is kind of the blues and greens and teals. There's that part of it. We've got blues and purples. This goes from like turquoise to a dark navy. Doesn't that look like the ocean running in there? Those bubbles. The purples and teals and blues. Really pretty. So we got that one. The next is the purples. And if you noticed, it matches this one. Okay. 
Northcott makes beautiful fabrics. Very dark purples all the way you kind of think of. You, you look at this and you think, oh, maybe those crystal geodes or something or, or a river. Just your imagination runs when you see fabrics like this, doesn't it? out of the way. And now we've got colors. This one here is the fourth one. There's four in that set of the ombres, the Bliss ombres. Kind of the black and the grays and the blues. Beautiful set of colors in there. And of course it matches some of these other fabrics. This is a bubble, the Bliss Bubbles. Isn't that fun? You see how they all match. It's got the blues and the grays. Isn't that pretty? Now, Northcott also makes a line of blenders called Tuscana and they're kind of a modeled look. We've got a light gray. We've got, this one is called Morning Mist. Look how that all blends together. I believe this one's called Atmosphere. Now look at all these together. Don't they kind of blend together? Well, we just got these in, but they're part of a line that we're coming in. I'm going to tease you. There's a new line coming in and it's called Soar. It's a beautiful line that has eagles in the morning mist and flying in the atmosphere and you know, water down below. So it's coming um, maybe in a couple months, but this is kind of the precursor to that. So you can see the beautiful, we'll, we'll tease you with those beautiful colors and we'll, we'll definitely introduce you when the soar is coming in. So lots of fun still coming. Now we're going to walk back here. Let's see, we've talked about uh, next weekend is graduation weekend, right? So we have, we, we talked about our hours and we're going to be here. And what's the last day of? What? What's oh, today? What's today? Today is the last day of the serger sale. Now, we have been selling these B64s like hotcakes. We've got three of them left. They are $999. That only happens every so often. I mean, it's a rare happening. That is an awesome price on that. But it's not just that on sale. We have all of our sergers on sale. Look at our nifty L890 that we have here. Okay, you saw Denise doing a wonderful demonstration yesterday on how to make a really cool fast headband, L890. Okay, so you don't want the cover stitch and all the bells and whistles. We've got an air threading serger here. This is called the L860. It's got the screen on it. All you have to do to change something is just touch it and move it. If you don't like it, you put it back. That easy. Air threading sergers, beautiful. Okay, so the screen doesn't, you know, do anything for you. You just want a workhorse of a serger, an L850. Air threading, you know, how, how easy is that? And with our 8 series, we're having an in-store deal. You get a $750 store credit. Okay, that buys a lot of feet. Right now, the foot of the month is 25% off of all the Bernina serger feet. There's some wonderful feet. These, these go with these Berninas. That's Berninas and Burnettes. So we have those. Today's the last day. We'd love to sell those three boxes. Okay, we're gonna go into the classroom in here. We have one final thing. Let's see if we can stop by these patterns over here and find it. We 
we have a whole wall of quilt patterns, everybody. This is for the Bliss Ombre, okay? You saw those four color schemes. All you need are those four fabrics to make these beautiful quilts. Okay, you need some of the bubble fabrics too. All right, here's another one. It's called Stratify. And you can see how they've highlighted those beautiful gradations that you do in there. So if you have, I mean, you could use any um, ombre sort of fabric. We have several of them around here and you probably have seen them too elsewhere, but those are, those are two new patterns that we have over there. And you can pan around and see our wonderful store. We've got a whole clearance section back there. Don't forget we have uh, Tim Holtz abandoned sewing theme stuff. We got panels. And we have a classroom. I know you've seen the classroom before, but today we're set up. We are going to be doing a um, class on the Vernina software. And today's why it went to sleep over there, Dave. Anyway, okay, we're doing software, and it's applique. Can you see the computer screen? Once a month, Bernina has the Community Studio software. It's the version 9, but we do lessons on all of the new nifty features that it can do. So today's class is called Applique Amplified. There's two or three different ways to do applique. Okay, we can do um, reverse applique. We can do raw edge applique. This design is technically a raw edge. It has been tacked down over the edge, but you may see some fuzzies. It's not tacked down with a satin stitch. So that's today's lesson on that. Well, guess who's watching? Oh, Margaret. Is Margaret watching? Good morning, <laughs> Margaret. We're ready for the day. Hope you're having a good one. Um, is there anything else I need to say, Dave? All right. We're done a little early, but that's okay. We're going to have a busy day here at the University of Sewing, so please come and join us. We'd be happy to have you, and um, you guys have a great day. Don't forget to share. Okay, bye.